If you're into AI writing or coding, you'll want to pay attention because OpenAI has just launched a major new feature called Canvas. This isn't just a small update, it has the potential to significantly change how we collaborate with AI, especially for complex projects. I've gone through demos and behind the scene details and I'm going to explain it all. If you've used to chat GPT to write emails or generate code, you probably notice it's good but still struggles with more complex tasks. OpenAI has been listening and they've created Canvas, a brand new interface that goes beyond a typical chat window. With Canvas, you and chat GPT can collaborate side by side in a dedicated workspace. Instead of typing commands and waiting for responses, you can generate text or code directly in the workspace, highlighting sections for the AI to refine and get suggestions, edits, or even complete rewrites. Currently, Canvas is in beta for ChatGPT Plus and Teams users. Enterprise and education plans users will get access next week and eventually it will be available to everyone even on free tier. But for now, you'll need one of the paid plans to use it. So, how do you use Canvas? You can either manually select GPT-4 with Canvas from ChatGPT's model picker or here's the cool part. ChatGPT will automatically detect when Canvas might be useful for your project and open the window for you. For instance, if you're working on something long or handling complex coding tasks, Canvas will pop up automatically. You can also just type use Canvas in the chat if you want to open it manually. For writers, this is a game changer. During a demo, OpenAI product manager Daniel Levine demonstrated how Canvas can help generate emails. Instead of getting the email in the regular chat format, it opens in the Canvas window and from there, you have a ton of useful tools. For example, if the email is too long, there's a slider that lets you adjust its length, making it shorter or longer. You can also highlight specific sentences and ask ChatGPT to make them sound friendlier or even add emojis to lighten the tone. You can also translate your entire document into another language right in Canvas, making it incredibly flexible. For writers, there's a handy feature called Final Polish. This tool checks your draft for grammar, clarity, and consistency so it's ready to send or publish without needing to go over every detail yourself. Think of it as your personal editor on standby. Want to add emojis? There's a quick shortcut for that too, letting you easily insert them into your text if that's your style. If you're working on more in-depth projects like blog posts or longer documents, ChatGPT can suggest inline edits, highlight potential improvements, and even rewrite sections for you. Plus, you can toggle between different versions of your text, so if you don't like the changes, you can simply revert to a previous version. If you're a coder, Canvas is where things get even exciting. Many of us use ChatGPT for quick coding fixes or generating APIs, but it's not always ideal for larger projects. With Canvas, OpenAI has introduced features that make coding more collaborative and easier to track. When you generate code, it appears in the Canvas window where you can instantly add comments with the press of a button. This is super helpful for inline documentation. You can highlight a section of code and ask a chat GPT to explain what it does or get answers to a specific questions. Canvas also has a review code button that analyzes your entire script and suggests specific edits. If ChatGPT detects a bug or sees room for improvement, it will propose changes. You can approve, tweak, or reject these suggestions, and if you're approved, ChatGPT will attempt to fix the code itself. You're not just getting assistance, you're actively collaborating with the AI to improve your code. Other helpful coding features include adding logs and comments, debugging, and even even porting your code to another language, all in one seamless workplace. Canvas can even translate code between languages like Python, JavaScript, PHP, Java, and C++. It's more than just a coding tool, it integrates smoothly into your workflow, making each step more efficient. 
This shift with Canvas reflects a broader trend in the AI industry where AI is evolving from merely providing answers to becoming a true collaborator. It's helping you work through tasks in real time and anticipating your needs before you even ask. In the past, AI chatbots were useful but limited. They struggled with large projects from single prompt, requiring a lot of back and forth adjustments and sometimes forcing you to start over. Canvas changes that by making the process of refining your work much smoother. Instead of going through multiple iterations, you can edit and fine-tune your work directly within the Canvas window. OpenAI isn't alone in this space. Competitors like Anthropic with its tool Artifacts and Google's Gemini are working on similar AI-driven collaborative workspace. It's an exciting race and we're witnessing a major evolution in how AI assists with tasks. A fun fact, some key features behind Canvas have left OpenAI. John Coleman, a co-founder, joined competitor Anthropic in August and former CTO Mira Muradi and VP Research Barrett Z stepped down right before the Canvas launch. Despite these changes, OpenAI remains confident. During a press event, Chief Product Officer Kevin W. said these departures aren't slowing them down. In fact, he predicts that by 2025, AI systems will truly go mainstream, not just as tools but as digital agents capable of completing tasks on their own. This beta version of Canvas is just the beginning. OpenAI plans to make Canvas even smarter with faster triggers, improve accuracy in identifying what needs editing, and more advanced features. They've hinted at making coding edits more transparent so you can easily track what the AI changed. GPT-4, the engine behind Canvas, was trained using synthetic data, meaning it was taught with AI-generated data to enhance how well it collaborates on writing and coding tasks. This training includes over 20 automated evaluations, which OpenAI claims significantly improved the model's ability to make precise, targeted edits. One of the biggest challenges they addressed was teaching the AI when to make minor changes and when a full rewrite was necessary, particularly in coding. They fine-tuned it into rewrite only when absolutely needed, which is important because no one wants an AI that over-edits or unnecessarily rewrites their work when a small fix would have sufficed. <laughs> With competition heating up between OpenAI, Anthropic, and Google, we can expect some incredible innovations over the next year. If you're excited about what Canvas can do, be sure to try it out if you're on ChatGPT Plus or Teams. For everyone else, stay tuned. Canvas will roll out to all users once it exits beta. That's it for today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and let me know in the comments what you think about Canvas. Are you going to try it out? Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.